for Veolia Water, formerly Suez. I've been with the company for 30 years. Uh, I've wanted to get involved with the Chamber of Commerce for a long time. Being the water utility for Hudson County, it's important that we're there to meet everyone and meet everybody's needs in Hudson County. It's really nice to give a speech or talk to people without looking at your television all the time. Hi, I'm Catherine Tantillo. I'm, he I'm head of social impact at Lord Abbott. Lord Abbott is incredibly proud to partner with the Hudson County Chamber of Commerce. It's no surprise that the last two years have been extremely challenging for all of us. While the pandemic may have changed many things in our lives, how we conduct business was certainly one of them. But the Chamber has conducted business over the last two years as business as usual. And so I want to thank again the Board for helping us to do all of that. And more importantly, today marks a milestone where we can all come together for probably, it's not exactly the first time, but let's call it at least this first meeting in two years, uh, being live as you know Tom had uh, alluded to earlier, there is no substitute. So this is certainly a milestone. So thank you all for joining us today and for being here and for being part of the Hudson County Chamber of Commerce. Hi, my name is Sharon Ambis. I'm a marketing and public relations strategist in Hudson County, New Jersey. I've been involved with the Chamber now going on, ooh, I hate to say about 20 years. But one of the best things that the Chamber has is networking. We have an amazing group of Chamber members who do business with each other. And I'm very happy to also report that we have a very diverse board. And today, at our annual meeting, we will be announcing a new slate showing that diversity. I'm Pat DeSanto, Provident Bank. We have been a longtime member of the Chamber of Commerce and we're proud members and large supporters. We enjoy being part of the Chamber to meet all the businesses um, in, in Jersey City and Hudson County. It helps the bank um, expand its footprint and we view the Chamber as a vital part of our marketing strategy to help us um, uh, develop new clients, new sources of business for the bank, and to reach out to the community and uh, engage all the business leaders within the community. Hi, I'm Dr. Bernard McSherry, and I'm the Dean of the NJC School of Business, and uh, I just want to say what a pleasure it is to be here at the Hudson Chamber event. Um, the Chamber is a vitally important part of Hudson County, and they've been a wonderful partner for New Jersey City University. It's, it's so wonderful to be involved with an organization that brings together people from across the business world, both small businesses, large businesses, and we've had this wonderful opportunity to connect our students with businesses and uh, to help our programs and, and our professors and our students stay relevant. Diana Pombo with the Hudson County Chamber of Commerce. Uh, talking to you here today from the annual business meeting at the lovely Liberty House in Jersey City. What a great view we have here. What a great view I have behind me, everyone networking. I'm so excited to be a part of this organization. I'm looking forward to myself and Haven Savings Bank being a part of this community and helping uh, Hudson County accelerate our small businesses. Together we all thrive. Um, I'm exciting for what's ahead in 2022.